every day we live, you can tell me shit. Remember I was broke, now I'm getting rich. Take a nigga, take a nigga drink, just to know you live. We need to talk about my nigga PNB Rock. RP PNB Rock as we still following this case. Now apparently, I've heard some reports that apparently they caught the father. I thought he was on the run, but apparently they possibly could have caught him now. And now all the family, it was a family affair. The stepmama, his little son was the shooter. And his father was like the getaway driver in my opinion. Now the father went on the run. Apparently now they caught him. I'm not 100% sure. But that's what I've been hearing. But now we're here to talk about this. Because potentially, because it says in the shooting timeline reveals a potential fourth suspect. And now we're here to talk about it. So you already know the deal. What's up? What's happening? It's K.A. We back in this thing. K. So got a sleep with a cutter up a throne. You know the little boy want a ton. Like, subscribe, help your boy. Y'all help your boy grow. You know what it is. You know I'm the kid. You know I taught my itty bitty flizz. You heard me. Yeah, you heard me. And let's talk about this now. New details have emerged uh, revealing that PNB Rock's girlfriend was also robbed by the same gunman last month. PNB was peacefully laid to rest at just 30 years old last month. But the Los Angeles Police Department continues to investigate exactly what led up to the recording artist being fatally shot in front of his girlfriend at roscoe's chicken and waffles by the way wherever that roscoe's is located like niggas yeah yeah i just gotta stop going over there like it it, 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 it ain't a good look we gotta stop going over there but anyways according to the uh new report from fox 11 los angeles the selfish hit maker's death may have a fourth suspect who authorities are currently on the hunt for as they as they say this person likely played an instrumental role in the fatal shooting the LA shared that uh, prosecutors believe there was an unidentified man outside the restaurant on the city south side when PNB arrived to dine with his partner he waited until Freddie Lee throne who was already arrested in connection with the murder along with his 17 year old son earlier this week arrived outside the joint and the two were seen having a conversation before Throne left and returned with his son whose name remains anonymous at this time the teen was reportedly dropped off within walking distance of roscoe's when entering the restaurant he allegedly pointed a gun at rock's partner uh steph sib i, I can't say the name but steph telling her to give him all of her jewelry now reports reveal that pnb born Rakim Allen was shot in the chest just moments later. The gunman hit the recording artist twice more in the back after he fell to the ground, then turned back to Steph and said, Show me your hands, give me that right now. I swear to God, I'll shoot you in the head. After Steph gave over all of her possessions, the attacker proceeded to remove Allen's chains, watch, and even his rings as he laid bleeding on the floor. The suspect is said to have ran outside to his father's car afterwards, with the two then returning to their home. These new details provide a different timeline of events than the one authorities initially believed when the 17-year-old unnamed throne was arrested on Tuesday, September 27th. So there's a fourth nigga now, and we don't know. Now, the rest of them I've been said have been locked up, and now there's a fourth person. An unidentified man that was talking to the family. I don't know if he had the drop. I don't know if he contacted the family, like, hey, yo, PNB's here. Hey, y'all yeah, yeah, gonna come do what you do, and you give me my cut because I told you that you was over here or whatever the fuck you want to say. With that being said, sorry, there's some bullshit bothering me. With that being said, that is just wild. And let's not act like that doesn't happen. We see movies, and there might be a nigga who puts niggas on. A little situation, you get a little cut. Y'all do the heavy lifting, you get a little cut because he told you about it. But with that being said, it's still wild. Now, again, I thought they got all three of the people. It was a family affair. I thought they got all three of the people. And we could move past this and everybody could be well, you know. PNB Rock left behind some children. So at least the family in general could get some solace on the situation now that it's over. And they could try to move on. It will be difficult, but at least they can try. Now we have more information with this. And ooh, honestly, I'm not surprised because I was saying this with the whole time. Everybody's like, yo, girls should stop posting location. And which she should. But with that being said, it's like, yo, the nigga end up, it, it cooking could have been a gang member. Like, hey, yo, bro, over here. Whoever in the restaurant could have been like, hey, yo, bro, over here. You know, y'all come hit a lick. Da, 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 da. Let's not act like, bro, niggas can't go to Roscoe Chicken and Waffles now. Let's not act like, 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 bro, that's just like some high-end restaurant. Any nigga could go over there and get some, get some grill. 
With that being said, man, it just was what it was, my nigga. It just was what it was. It sucks that this has happened. It does suck. It does, but at the same time, what the fuck can you do, bro? It is what it is. Yeah, man. All I can really say is hopefully his family does get justice and they figure this out sooner than later so they can get justice and they could try to move on. It's still going to be difficult, but at least they can try. So again, my condolences again to PMB Rock, his friends, his family, of course the fans. I am a fan as well. And hopefully we figure this out soon. These people are scum. They deserve to be brought to justice. You know what I'm saying? They care about some niggas. Don't get fucked up. I ain't gonna act like yo. My nigga was on the run. I would want that nigga to be on the run. I ain't gonna act like that. But again, when you care about a nigga, bro, let's keep it a book. We know how this shit go. But even though we know how this shit go, that is our loved one, bro. We want justice for him. It's not a nigga we don't know. So, hey, my condolences to PNB Rob. But besides all that, you already know what it is. What do you feel in the comments down below? Check out the links in the description. I got some other vids for y'all to check on. Besides all that, you already know what it is. It's your friendly neighborhood, K.A. Signing off for today. The Black TJ Dead Wilder doing this thing. My name ring bells like Quasimodo. Hit like and subscribe if you want to hear a little bit more. And I'm gone. Shlamzoom, peace, y'all. Aye!